Okay, so it's Tuesday and I'm getting a little later and start later um, on blogging or vlogging this week. Yesterday, so we didn't really do a ton of stuff. I had a lot of work I had to finish in the morning. And then I... Um, Mom, yes. you going to go to see this shirt and the story. I am going to show this shirt. Just wait. Okay, I'll show the shirt in a minute. Okay. Um, but anyways, so, we just went to a friend's now? house. I'm vlogging. Can you just wait a moment? Sorry. Thank you. But we went to a friend's house yesterday. Well, two friends house, her friends. She played with her friends yesterday for a little bit in the afternoon. And then we went to another friend's house and had fajitas and watched um the bachelorette uh the men tell all, which was wild. But anyways, and my brain's just all over the place. I'm all jacked up this week, I feel like, because I didn't go work out yesterday. And I usually start off every Monday working out. And then I was planning on doing my at-home workout, but then didn't end up doing that either. So here I am. But I am going to go work out tonight. Um, I'm taking the brawl kickboxing class at Barcode. I may or may not end up recording some of it. Um, stop moving this table, please. Um, just because... I haven't been to that particular class in a long time, so I kind of need to like get my groove again before I record it. Um, but I am planning on taking that class Thursday, so I'll be sure to record it on Thursday along with my bar class Thursday, and then I'm taking um, total body conditioning tomorrow, so I'll probably end up recording that. But anyways, um, I ended up finding my stabilizer. Um, and it's like a little mini tripod situation. So that's what this is sitting on now So now like the view is way better than you like seeing like my stomach the entire time like last week So I'm getting it together um, Hold on, okay, I'll get them for you in a minute, okay? Um, but I did want to show you real quick what I just got from Target because we did run to Target We're taking Bentley tonight to go see the Lion King and I already have a shirt, which I showed you guys a couple weeks ago that I bought locally, but I ended up getting her. Oh, I just realized I got 4T, but that's fine. Oh, um, that's so cool. Am this I... shirt. Isn't it so cute? Whoa. But this is the one that she liked. They had a couple different options, but she really liked this one with like baby Simba and baby Nala on it. Baby. Here. So. So she'll probably end up wearing that this shirt tonight. baby. This baby Luna. Come on, you can show right here. Come I on. could try it. This, okay. this, uh, this, like this. Okay, yeah. Lion King movie might be in the sh shirt. Right, exactly. Yeah, but you're going to wear that shirt tonight. Here, hold it up like this. Yeah, and you're going to wear that shirt. You like me. Yeah, tonight to the movie, okay? But go put it over there, and then um, I'll put it on you in a little bit, okay? Okay. Go on. So then the other thing that I ended up buying right, right while up. I was there, um, I've been eyeing these jeans for a while and they never had my size at the uh, location kind of closest to me. So I've just been trying to like checking every time just to make sure they had them. But I'm super obsessed with this um, Wild Fable brand at Target. It's like, I think it's replaced that exhilaration brand they used to have or whatever was like their juniors brand. But all of the pieces in Wild Fable are super, super like on trend. Like they have biker shorts and a ton of leopard print and neon and fanny packs and like all that stuff. But I um, love like a mom jean fit and these are their high rise mom jeans. And they're just straight. They have like a little frayed, um, there you go. Yeah, like a little frayed hem. And then, uh, yeah, like they don't have any holes in them, which a lot of my jeans have holes in them. So I was happy to find a pair that didn't have any holes in them. And they're just like a nice high rise. But I'm excited to have these because I don't have a lot of lighter wash pairs of jeans. Um, and these, the fit for some reason of the Wild Fable jeans are just so good. Like I have a pair, um, they're put away right now but they're high-waisted and like a wide leg cropped pair um, and they're gray that I got last winter and I wore them like so much last winter so I was happy to find another pair of jeans. Hey, stop moving this. It's sitting up here. I don't want it to fall. Okay. What else do you have to say? Because I'm going to sign off. No, no sign off. Do you have to say anything else? No. Okay. Well, let me get her her 
fruit snacks um, because I have to actually get ready pretty soon to go work out. But yeah, and then we have to take her to the movie too. So I guess I'm starting my week officially on Tuesday <laughs> this week. Um, hey, but yeah. You're that. So I just finished my class at um, Barcode. I thought I was going to die, but I didn't. Making sure this car isn't going to hit me. <laughs> oh my goodness. Golly. Okay. But I thought I was going to die. I didn't die. Um, I haven't worked out since last Friday. And so I took Brawl, which is the kickboxing class. Basically cardio for... 50 minutes <laughs> so oh my gosh but I was like dripping sweat and it was so cute because there was one of the girls in there it was her hundredth class and it was like so sweet and she got like a special pair of socks and everybody was like clapping for her and everything it's just awesome um, anybody who's been to the barcode whether it's like in your city or here the community level is always just like so high and so you could just tell that like everybody was super proud of her for hitting 100 classes and like it felt like you hit 100 classes <laughs> so that was really really cool and like cool to see and like made me excited to like hit 100 classes one day <laughs> um but anyways i am now gonna be headed home i have to hop in the shower super super fast throw on my lion king stuff and take bentley to the movies because that movie is at 8 and it is now 7 26. <laughs> fortunately i live right around the corner so it shouldn't be too hectic for me to do all that, but we'll see. recorded the warm-up and I should have recorded when we were doing stuff with the body bar we did a lot of floor stuff too um, but I need to still get used to recording myself <laughs> uh, so yeah I'll try to incorporate more of the actual movement next time but yeah it's just a lot to think about I was already running just like a tad bit late this morning anyway so when I rolled up, it was like, so, like I just had to like hurry up. Like they were already starting when I got there cause I was taking forever to like, just wash my face this morning. Um, but anyways, yeah, it was a really, really good class. Whew. So <laughs> I'm happy about that. It's actually kind of chilly this morning. It says it's 60 degrees right now. But when it's been 90 for the past like two or three weeks consistently, like 60 feels cold. <laughs> so I have my jacket on and everything too. But um, today is Wednesday. So I'll definitely be heading home. I might run and get a smoothie real quick. Um, but I'm going to head home, do a little bit of work actually. Yeah, I have a little bit of work that I need to do before Bentley wakes up. Dropping her off to our friend today who watches her for us. And then I have a lunch meeting, AKA tacos, and hopefully a margarita for lunch. Um, and a photo shoot later with Ashley for our Sincerely Currently. So hopefully I can vlog all of that. Whew. Side note, we uh, booked, I totally didn't even think about it, but we booked our 10 year anniversary trip, which is crazy because our ninth anniversary is at the end of next month, but we already booked our 10th anniversary trip just because it's gonna be in the spring. We're doing it a little bit early, um, but we're planning on going to Cozumel. We've never taken a real vacation before 
and we didn't take a honeymoon because we were like 12 when we got married <laughs> so we were like poor <laughs> like broke and like babies <laughs> but now we're still broke but business owners so that's a whole nother situation um but i'm really really excited about it it's all inclusive and like i've never been on a trip like that before so it'll be exciting to like experience something different for like a really special anniversary but again that's not until 2020 and we still have no idea what we want to do for our actual anniversary this year but i'll keep you posted on that and that's about it So we're about to roll back into Target again. Again. Because there was stuff that I forgot when I came earlier in the week. Um, stop by McDonald's. If you see me with a fry and a shake, I'm either super stressed or super happy. But I think today I'm stress eating. I don't know why. But I always want this when I'm stressed or if I'm super happy about stuff all year long it doesn't even have to be summer um okay. that's something else i was gonna say my box. why did you put your food down please hold in the tree get under the tree here you have zazu in the tree okay you have fries in there you can finish your fries um Anyways, tonight I'm going to the menu at Saab and Yard. Some friends of ours, um, a couple weeks ago, well, probably last week or the week before, when I vlogged, I went over to my friend Liz's house um, for her event, and she's doing another event. But this time it's at a local restaurant. It's their second one this summer, and so I'll be headed there tonight. I have no idea what I'm going to wear. That's why I don't have any makeup on right now. So I know I'm going to put on makeup <laughs> later tonight. Um, but yeah, I meant to vlog a little bit more yesterday, but it was so crazy when me and Ashley were trying to shoot. It was just like so busy because we were shooting in downtown Grand Rapids and like all the cars and everything and just so much activity like on the sidewalk. It's, it was crazy. And it was a weird time too that we were shooting so we were surprised it was so busy but yeah so that's pretty much it i'm gonna down these fries finish a little bit more of the shake and then roll in here and get everything else that i need and i guess go home and start getting ready well i need to finish some work stuff and then <laughs> start getting ready <laughs> oh yeah and okay so i forgot to tell you so I, i'm stress eating but i think i was just super super exhausted like i've been pushing myself too much um last night i went to bed well i got in the bed at 9 45 i don't remember falling asleep i slept through my alarm to work out this morning i usually work out at 5 30 or wake up to work out at 5 30 and when i did wake up it was like 8 30 8 45 this morning i don't know the last time i've been able to sleep that long um, but I was so wiped like I actually got um, Like I got home yesterday from shooting and I felt fine But then I don't know it was so weird like I Was sitting there on the couch and Bentley was watching a movie and then all of a sudden My whole body was just like super achy like it started hurting so bad and every time I got up, like my whole body was sore. And I was telling Josh, I was like, I'm just not feeling well. And he was like, well, you need to go lay down and like go to sleep or whatever. Um, but yeah, I was like, oh my gosh. And then I did, I went and lay down and I went to sleep. But this morning he was like, you're probably just pushing your body so much. He's like, you are always working out. He's like, which is great, but like you need to take a break. And yeah, just like on the go and everything, but. Ugh. and then this heat and just like so much is happening but yeah is anybody else feeling that way i don't know i don't know <laughs> I love you. 
guys so much. So it is Friday, and this mug is actually in honor of my husband, because <sighs> he's been getting on me about shopping. I did a no buy in June, meaning I did not step foot in Target that entire month. And this month, it's not out of control or crazy, but then nobody's supposed to help you feel more mindful about what you're shopping for. Ooh. But for me, when I get off of the no buy, it, I'm just like, give me all the things, give me all the things, give me all the things. Um, even though at the same time, I am still trying to be like, okay, I'm usually pretty good about sh only shopping for things um, that I do need or like that I don't have in my closet because I take really good inventory of what I have. Um, which I've done like a closet video in the spring um, where I like talked a little bit more about that but I don't know I'm at this weird point right now with the season where I'm like this is as nice as it's gonna be in West Michigan but at the same time like I don't want to invest in more summer clothes because like fall is gonna be coming soon and I'd rather buy things that will like transition into fall if that makes sense um, so yeah, that's kind of where I'm at <laughs> right now when it comes to all that stuff. But yeah, like he was talking to me yesterday and he was like, you need to chill with it. And I'm like, oh my gosh, like <laughs> a couple bags here and there where it's fine. Like they're from Target. It's fine. Um, but yeah, so last night was super fun. I didn't get as much footage <laughs> as I hoped. <laughs> But that means I was having a good time, right? I mean, I feel like that's what happens. Like, if I'm not posting, that means that I'm actually, like, in the moment, having fun, like, connecting with my friends and, you know, like, people that you see and you're like, hey, I know I follow you on Instagram, but I've never met you before and, like, that type of thing. And that's what events like that are for. So I'm happy that I was able to go and, like, was able to actually enjoy myself and have a good time and not just like be on my phone like posting and everything like that too even though I wish I had more footage for vlogging but I know that you understand and you get it um one thing I did want to show you though is I got so many compliments last night Mama, on my bag yes honey get some more treats? uh yeah I'll get some in a couple minutes okay I'll get it for you in a minute all right <laughs> I thought you want just go finish finish your crackers right now and I'll get you some more cheese okay um, but yeah, so I got this cute bag. I just got it from, um, oh my gosh, I just got it from Target. Sorry, I got it from Target yesterday. They had like their bags on sale and I have my fanny pack that you know about, the key fanny pack, that snake print one. And I love it because I do like wearing it up here crossbody, but it doesn't fit me around my waist. Like even if I take it to the smallest like that it can go it's still like it's loose and so I really wanted to find like a cute like fanny pack or waist bag that I can put around my waist and this is perfect Bentley what did I tell you about moving this look at this this is like a uh, clover field um so yeah but it's super cute because it zips it has these two pockets in the front um like I was able to put my keys in here yesterday and like my lipstick and stuff and then it's just like open on the inside and then I have this little like wallet that I have in here um that's the same brand because this is that like a new day brand or whatever um so yeah it was on sale Bentley excuse me I will get it for you in one moment you're already eating something like that's what I don't understand she's eating what she asked for and then she asks for other things and it's like but you're eating my cheese I want my cheese and my plate you ate all the cheese yes okay well I will get you more cheese let's go get her more cheese because this is getting ridiculous let's get some 
some more cheese. I'll get you more cheese. Give me your plate. Like, you have all this whole apple on this plate, 85 crackers on this plate, but you eat all the cheese. Should have just asked me for cheese. Um, but anyways, I wonder if I can set this up here. Hold on one minute. I'm just gonna like, there we go. Um, but yeah, anyways, I got that cute little bag and I got so many compliments on it last night. Um, just because like, I think everybody's still like surprised that fanny packs are not only like a thing again, but like that there are cuter versions of the ones that we had in like 1996 or whatever. Um, so whenever I am wearing one, whether it's my one by that key brand or if it's another kind, um, like that one that I just got yesterday, I always get compliments on it because everybody's like, oh, fanny packs can be a thing, but they can also be like a cool thing. Um, so yeah. Oh yeah. And my face, by the way, I'm just, I mean, you can't see my face right now, but, um, totally last night's makeup still. I came home, I got home around midnight and I literally just like came home and went right to bed. Um, and the, I showered this morning too and I forgot to take my face wash in, so I didn't end up washing my face. <laughs> so I'll probably just like wash my face after this. I'm so bad about that. As much as I love, like, and I'm trying to get more into skincare or whatever. Um, so as much as I'm loving all of the like skincare finds and like all that stuff, um, I don't know, like I still am really bad about washing my makeup off at night. Here. <laughs> That's how I am. Take your food. Um, but yeah, but anyways, what else was I gonna say? I am thinking about um, doing a what I bought this month <laughs> video with all of that being said earlier about my whole shopping situation. But um, I do buy things like throughout the month just in general and not even always just like clothes or like accessories and everything but um i have been trying like new skincare and like i bought more things like earlier this month that i've been using and just in general so if that is something that you'd be interested in seeing definitely let me know um in the comments because that's a video that i would love to do um i have thought about like what i wore this month but or like this week and stuff but it's so hard for me especially during the day because depending on what i'm doing i'm probably not going anywhere but i don't have anybody to like take photos of me every day during the day and i'm not gonna have bentley learn how to use a camera she already knows how to use my phone but i'm not gonna do like child labor and like have her like taking pictures of me or whatever so I do need to get a mirror though, so maybe I'll just get a mirror and just try to be more like mindful of like, hey, like this is my outfit that I have on. Um, so yeah, I think that's why I end up just doing lookbooks of like general outfits that I probably wear, you know, like every season, because that's just like easier for me at the end of the day than like trying to get my outfits every day or like throughout the month. I so I don't know, toying around with that too, but let me know for sure. Um, as far as today goes, this probably will be the only time you see me unless we end up doing something exciting. Um, this is one of our few chill days that we have this week. I have a full day tomorrow, so definitely we'll be showing all of that. Um, but yeah, so I'm probably just going to be here cleaning, doing some final work. I try to have all of my work done by one o'clock on Fridays. So that way, like if me and her need to go to the store, if I take her to the P-A-R-K, I'm not gonna say that out loud. Um, then I like can actually do that and not have to worry about like having a post for clients and doing stuff like, for me and like stuff like that too. So yeah, I guess it's all about balance and what I can do. And just doing the best that I can do, I guess. But actually, it's Friday, so I do need to call my friend. Um, my, I talk to my best friend. We FaceTime every Friday morning because that's like the only time that we can kind of talk. But I'm trying to go visit her sometime in the end of August, early September. So we're trying to coordinate stuff. So I actually do need to go so I can talk to her before she goes to work. <laughs> um, but yeah, I guess that's all. That's all for now.